Hi guys, look who's with me today, Miss Jamie. And I'm gonna read for March 24th out of our Blessings Every Day book. A special creation. You know all about me, you are all around me. Psalm 139. When you paint a picture, you choose the colors you want and put them where you think they should go. When you make a snowman, we don't make snowmen. <laughs> when you make a sandcastle, you decide where the, the moat's gonna be. I, I'm changing the words because it said snowman. When you make something, you know everything about it. When God made you, he picked out all your parts and put them together. So he knows and loves everything about you. You are his special creation. God knows me well, inside and out. He knows what I am all about. Okay, Miss Jamie, what have you made? Did you make anything cool recently? Do you paint? Do you color? Did you make something with your class for the art show? Yes. What did you make? We made um, flowers out of crepe paper. And you cut the paper or? I you... ripped them up for them and then they put them on there. So she took like the tissue paper like we've yes, done before? Tissue paper. And you rip it? Yes. And then what did you glue it onto? A uh, canvas and let them decorate it. So it's one flower or a bunch of flowers? A bunch of flowers, whatever they make. How did you it. how did you know um, how did you know how to make it? Like is it in a vase? Is there a vase on the canvas? Did you draw a vase? No. I just let them put it wherever they wanted. So everybody put their own flower in different areas? Yes. So you have oh, probably add a vase. You once we all finish. So how many flowers are on the canvas? Just a couple, because it's their own for each canvas. Oh, each person has their yes. own little canvas, and they made their own flowers. Yes. Did you make one? No. No, just they did? They did. Did you make something? I thought you made something. You had to have made something. You're crafty. Do you make jewelry? No. Your sister makes jewelry? Yes. Sometimes I help her. Do you make anything for the classroom? Sometimes. <laughs> hmm. I like to organize if that's the same thing. Yeah. I like to clean. So how do you know where things are going to go when you organize? Like, what do you organize? Just the whole room. Like the art cabinet. At your house or inside the classroom? In the classroom. So every... Thing has its own space. Yes. And you guys could do that too. You could take some art materials at home and put them into different places. What do you so use to separate to yours? Containers. Kind of like this. Yes. Little containers. Little buckets. Yeah. And then do you have pictures on the side that shows yes. what's inside? Mm -hmm. So then you know easy, where to put it back. Easy to get to when you want to do art or. So God knows that Miss Jamie's an organizer. <laughs> yes. Is that part of the reason you wanted to be a teacher? Because you like to get everything in the yes. right place? Yes. Yeah. Well, that's awesome about Miss Jamie. Some of you had her as a teacher. Do you want to say anything to the kids that you used to teach? I miss you guys. It's only been a week, but it feels longer than that. Right? Doesn't it? Yes. I don't even know what day it is. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we're recording for tomorrow, and tomorrow is going to be Tuesday the 24th. Tuesday. Thank you, Miss Jamie. You're welcome. Thank you.